Hi, it's Phil from TeachBlend, and in this video we're going to look at Kahoot's new feature, which is the Equation Editor. So what this allows you to do is it allows you to put mathematical formulas and equations directly into Kahoot questions and response answers. I hope you find this video useful. I'm going to start creating a Kahoot as usual, and then I'm just going to show you very quickly how you actually start entering a question. So in here you just start typing in a question, for example, solve, and then you could insert your mathematical formula. You can bold, attack add superscript and subscript as well and you can also insert symbols and these are kind of common and you used to use these before so for example you can insert currency and some math symbols and Greek now what you can do now is a lot more powerful so let's have a look at the equation editor in here you can actually now start to enter in really complex equations now this one is not a complex equation it's just four plus four but i'll show you how that works you just insert them so let's have a look now at fractions so what we're going to do is we're going to insert the fraction button at the bottom in math and you'll see two text holders and what you can do is you can put your fraction into those text holders and it will sort the rest out for you so these are kind of like placeholders for your numbers and for your actual fraction that you're inserting now let's have a look at a slightly more difficult example where I can show you a little bit more how this would work. So let's have a look at the quadratic formula, for example. Here you'll see that what I need to do is write x equals, and then I need to start adding a bit more. So the first thing I need to do is actually a fraction because it's going to be over. I'm going to write minus b plus minus and then I need to actually use a square root symbol. So I'm going to click the square root symbol now, and then I can start entering the rest of the equation in. I'm going to write B, but I need to do a square, so I'm going to click square, but then you'll see I need to go down a line, so I just simply click down a line to enter in the rest of the formula. The next bit then is easy, the text box is already under the divide or over, and then you can just click insert. So that's how you very quickly can insert fractions, functions, and equations into Kahoot. I hope you found this video useful, and if you did, give us a like and subscribe to TeachBlend. It really does help create more videos. Thank you very much.